What is up everybody? My name is Brian from Athenema Studios and today I'm going to be showing you guys how to get Pokemon Essentials and the necessary things with it to be able to use it and then later on we're going to be doing tutorials and whatnot. Now for this video I will be doing I guess you could say a torrent of some kind to get um, RPG Maker I think that's what it's called um, RPG XP is something like that. Um, I'm gonna be showing you guys how to get it for free. Now, if you do love using this program and you do get the money, definitely go buy the actual version to support the developers and all this stuff. But I just understand that some people can't get it and they're just looking to do this for fun or make one for with friends and whatnot. So that's what I'm doing. Uh, use it at your own use. Uh, like I said though, if you do like it, help the developers out. Okay, so you're going to be needing um, three things here. You're going to need Pokemon Essentials. Now, you're going to need the newest version. Um, for me right now, the newest version is the December 2014 one with a patch update thing, uh, 2015 uh, update log. Uh, you can tell which one you have because right here it says I need 1.5 version, which is right here. Now, if this is the same version as you, you can easily just download the file in the description below, and it's going to have everything you need. The next thing you're going to need is um, RPG XP fully registered version. You just want to download that, and you're also going to need the ARM XP uh, keygen. You're going to need this too. Uh, now, after you download all of that, see, I already have it right here. Um, the first thing we want to do is get the Pokemon Essential set up. So what we're going to do is we're going to extract here. So this is going to be one folder. There it is. It's going to take a few seconds. All right, we're just waiting here and boom. All right, so we're going to just open up Pokemon Essentials here. And as you see, we have Editor and Game. Um, there's one more thing here that we're going to grab just in a second, but we don't have it just yet. Um, now, if I open the game here... Okay, sorry, the volume was pretty loud. As you see, we have a Pokemon Essentials game here. Um, I have some fonts that I guess I have to put in my whatever. We'll worry about that a little later, though. As you see, we got a working uh, Essentials. This is like the demo beta. It comes with, I haven't really messed too much around with this because I just made my own new one, but. As you see, you have a working uh, Pokemon Essentials game. It's the one that comes with Pokemon Essentials. And here's the beginning with the Professor. You also have this thing called the Editor. Um, we'll get more into this into our tutorial series. But this works. But there's one thing that we're missing. And it's the actual Editor program where we build our maps and other stuff like that. And that's where the RPGX comes in. Oh, also, we need the little update real quick. So we're going to extract here. We got a readme text. Um, now, let's see. I'm pretty sure. Let me see where this goes here real quick. I haven't actually looked at this. Okay, we got to look in the data folder. Let's go do this real quick. And replace the two scripts. Okay, so we just look in the data folder. Grab these two scripts, put them in there, replace files, and done. Okay, cool. And get rid of that readme text. Because I can always go back and grab it if I need to. Alright. So the next thing you want to do is extract this here. It's going to take a few seconds. It's got three folders. Um, we don't need the readme. Uh, let's open this though. We're going to keep this open just real quick. Just put this aside. It really doesn't matter at this moment. And what you're going to do here is you're going to go to the RTP uh, standard full installer. And you're going to run up the setup menu. Click yes. Make sure you click this one. Uh, this one doesn't work. Uh, however, it doesn't work for me. Maybe it works for you. I just, let's just do this one, alright? Just click it. Give it a second to load up. Hit next. Make sure you don't go way too fast because 
um, just on the bright side that, oh, they want you to change your, uh, browser or something, so nothing like that happens, just keep clicking next, as you see nothing popped up, it's gonna take a few seconds to download, and click close, alright, we can exit that, now, we can actually exit this folder too, go to RPG XP, and run this, oh, hold on, you might, you're gonna have to run it as an administrator, or you're gonna get this error, so, run as administrator, it's gonna load up, and it's gonna have three options, buy now, continue with trial, or already paid, click already paid, now there's gonna be an activation code, hit generate, okay, over here you have a serial number, so, just copy and paste this serial number, so, the first digits, you kind of get the idea. Alright, so here we go. Now, for step two, it's going to say, select the message you would like to generate an activation code from. We're going to say web. We're going to hit web, and we're going to hit generate. This is going to bring this link up. Left click, copy this link. You can exit out of that after you copy it. Go over here. In the activation URL, hit control V, and hit generate. And here's your activation code. Go control C, click enter activation code, and press control V. Hit OK, and it says thank you for purchasing. Now that you got that, as you see it allows you to go back in RPG. Uh, we can exit out of this. Um, we can exit out of that too. Um, we're just going to hit install using compatibility settings in case it has any problems. Alright, there we go. Let's exit out of that. Now we're going to hop back into our Pokemon Essentials. Oh, let's see what that is. Yes, this program worked correctly. Now, in here, you're going to notice something called game.rxpproj. Just open with. And then, for some reason, it pops up, but you want to keep using the RPG Maker. Hit yes. It's going to load RPG Maker, and then boom, here's your Pokemon Essentials. Uh, we'll get into this all a little bit later, but here's the intro, here's uh, Lapid Town, um, which is basically Pallet Town. Um, yeah, some other cities they provided you with. Now, uh, in the tutorial series that is going to be coming soon, I will actually have our own little starter towns, some made and whatnot for you guys to use. So do mess with this, and when the tutorial series comes out, you can mess with this if you want. Um, but yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed. Make sure you hit that like button, subscribe button, and I will see you guys later.